So yeah, gotta do that. Up, One. Leroy Jenkins! Do that apothecary fight. Just make sure it, it does actually Turns say up, to, do this. to not do it on heroic. Oh, it's only a level 8 fight. This should be fucking easy. Especially if you like, like, if I can get, like, a power buff to Leroy's, um, nice. To, uh, Leroy's, um, stats, that'll be really useful. But if I can get whelps, that'll be really good. I should have showed the equipment which he used for Leroy, but it, you just use his, what, his, for, his task 2 equipment. Because his task 2 equipment makes this much more powerful. And just hope for good treasures. But it is possible without, good tre without treasures. See, if you can get treasure like that, that's a good treasure to get. But then he gets many stats. Knife handle it. Wouldn't have enough to kill the hyena though. Just hope we don't hit the snake. Oh wait, the snake's gonna just trade into him anyway. It's not too long anywhere to climb up here. More stats, more stats. Okay, more stats now. All fighters have wine fury. Time's up. Let's do this. Leroy Jenkins. He should probably one shot everything, hopefully. Nope. He's not going to one shot everything. Damn it, that hurt a little. Belly a dent though, moving right along. Oh no, <laughs> cringe. Cringe shot. Job's done. Shit, I need more power. But we get more stats, more stats, more stats. Okay, more stats now. So yeah, just try and get more stats or whelps. But the stats is probably better. Bit of luck, you can just nuke down the guy in the middle. Well, I'll kill the guy in the middle and the other guy, so I might as well just do this. Leroy Jenkins! Very big Leroy. Very quick bounty. Very easy. Easy. You love to see it. You love to see them actually put in easy bounties. You do need to level your Leroy to max level, but that's not really a problem. Like, just put everything into his... Like, it's quite simple what you need to do for this battle, though. 
like I'll show you after. I should have done this before, but I didn't. Because smooth in the membrane. So for the Leroy, you just need to upgrade this ability once so it can attack three different targets. And then just put everything into this one. Or into the sword. So then he does even more damage. See, this gives even more damage. Like, the chicken isn't really useful. Like, it's kind of useful, but it's kind of a waste of a turn. Like, it gives him immunity, but you don't really need it. If this is doing enough damage, you can just kill everything instantly. And with this attacking three targets, it can hit everything, pretty much. Does it go, go up if you do it again? But yeah, that one's that one. I did train Leroy quite a bit before then, because I knew there was some bounties that need it. And I'm going to need to train him even more, because I know one of them requires him to do a fuck ton of damage in one turn. Which is part of the reason I was increasing that first ability, because I know he needs to do a fuck ton of damage in one turn. Time's up, let's do this! Like, this doesn't really need upgrading again. Yeah, but this only gives it one attack. This gives it more, so I might as well upgrade this instead. But now it's unlucky. So, what, do we put Leroy on the team? No, not yet. Uh, who else do we need? For some reason, his thing's bugged. Hopefully they'll fix it soon, but this is a small indie company, so it's unlikely that they'll fix his thing anytime soon. We technically don't even need Leroy on the team. Like, it looks like Leroy and Millhouse's thing are going up without them even being on the team. So we need Chi-Chi and him. Maybe we could take out normal Anixia with the team. 